Good afternoon, UDA. I'm Jordan Zerby. And I'm Griffin Harmon. Reporting for Trojan News Network. Joke of the day. What do you call a broke Santa? Answer. St. Nickel Less. Reminder to all the students wishing to ride the activity bus, you must sign up in the office by 12.30 p.m. each day. Reminder to FFA members are reminded to pick up their fruit today from 2.35 to 7.30. The FFA will be holding their Christmas fun night December 16th, 6.30 to 8.30. There will be cookies, cookie decorating, ugly sweater contests, and lots more. Ms. Kramer's Discovery is collecting all brands of writing instruments to recycle, including glue sticks, paint sets, pens, pencils, and highlighters. Now through December 17th, the Discovery who brings in the most will win a donut party. Money earned through the recycling program will provide clean drinking water to a person who currently goes without. Thank you for your help. Trojan News reporters Adrian Asciano and Chris Barbara met with the members of the 2021 boys soccer team hosted at Motorsburg to recap this past season. Today we're here with Jeffrey Griffiths, defensive back for the Indians. Hi, I'm Isaiah Dyer. I'm a junior at Millersburg and I'm a captain on the soccer team. Uh, Jordan Pfeiffer, I'm a midfielder for the Millersburg uh, and Upper Dolphin co-op soccer team. If you could do this season all over again, Jeffrey, what would you do differently and are there any regrets? There is no regrets I have. I go into every practice, every game like it's my last. So me, I would do nothing different. I have no regrets from start to finish. What game was your favorite this season? And what was your favorite moment from that game and why? I think my favorite game was probably our first game against Susquehanna. We blew them out and I had two goals and two assists. And Marcus Tapper also had two goals. And I think we just played very well as a team. I think my favorite moment was also from that game when Jaden Kinzer sent me a header ball and I scored. That was probably my favorite goal. How have you gotten better as a player this year and what helped you progress as a player? I would say I definitely got more comfortable with the ball on my foot and was able to just do more skill moves. And I want to give a lot of that to the upperclassmen who, uh, you know, helped me figure those moves out and just continue to give motivation. If there was one thing to tell your teammates, what would it be? Um, I'd probably say uh, try to be more um, unselfish. I think this year we played uh, very selfishly and I think we could pass more and that would help us with more opportunities with scoring. How did soccer affect your life? Did it give you more friendships or more opportunities? It definitely gave me both. I've been playing soccer since I was little with most of the guys on the team this year. So I knew them pretty well even before the merger, but definitely opened me to better connections with those guys and I wouldn't trade the experience for anything else. Adriana and Chris, and congratulations, boys, on a good season. For lunch on Tuesday, we will be having creamy macaroni and cheese, steamed broccoli, stewed tomatoes, juicy sliced peaches, and low-fat milk. That's a wrap for TNN. Thanks for tuning in today. Have a great weekend, and remember, in the, in the Trojan, Trojan Nation, we are stronger together. together.